Hallelujah. Praise God. I'm, I'm really excited about this uh, vision that I want to share with us today. It's a vision about something I call the Global Church Net. Global Church Net. What's the Global Church Net? It's an online resource. It's an online community of believers of all shapes and forms and sizes, uh, even pre-believers, you know, pre-believers, fresh new believers, uh, mature believers. And the purpose of the online forum is, well, for the pre-believers, is to have classes like the Alpha class, where we introduce people to a living faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. On that same, um, on the same forum, we'll have classes for people who are new in their faith and they need basic discipleship, you know, basic discipleship, what's baptism, what's the Holy Spirit, what's the Bible. And then also we'll have more advanced classes uh, where we'll do a uh, prophetic and apostolic mentoring, mentoring in every area and every um, aspect of calling. And the aim of the online resource is to gather believers together, to disciple them, to mentor them, and then to release them to various callings that God has for them. There's, there's something unique about the apostolic and the prophetic when it comes to its ability to equip the saints. We know that all fivefold are actually given to equip the saints. But there's something about the apostolic and the prophetic that is able to do it with a largeness of heart where it's, it's not about me, it's not about my ministry, it's not about trying to gather numbers, but it's about trying to feed, trying to feed and to nurture every believer to fulfill uh, the, the great call, the great commission, and to fulfill the purpose for which God has uh, God, God has apprehended them, for the purpose for which God has saved them. You see, often um, when we're, if, often if we're church leaders, often we, we can lose sight of that, and we can be looking at numbers, you know, how many numbers are, are, are in the seats or in attendance. But we, we, we want to go away from that, we want to stray away from that, and we want to say our purpose is simply to empower others. So, What's, what's unique? Why do we call it Global Church Net? What we want to do is gather, like I said, this, this, this large, uh, hopefully large number of people online. And it's global. People can come in from Sweden, from Switzerland, from, uh, from, from Russia, from Tunisia, from South Africa, from Paraguay, wherever part of the world people can log in and receive this. Now, when we find that there's a significant cluster of people, could be in Brazil, could be in some in Somalia, we find there's a significant number of people, we then bring those people together and we say, hey look, why, why don't you have a, a barbecue together? <laughs> why don't you have a party together? Why don't you just have a, a, a celebration together? And the people come together in that particular part of the world, and when they come together in that part of the world, we, we begin to look, as they're coming together, we begin to look, are there put people with the calling of a church leader among them? And if we find that, ah, there are actually some potential church leaders there, then we begin to say, why don't you begin to meet every three months just to have some function, have some celebration where the, the, the social fabric is strengthened among you. Now, all the time we're, we're having weekly meetings, we're having discipleship meetings, we're discipling them, and bit by bit we begin to help where there's clusters of people in some part of the world, we begin to help them to transition from just an online gathering to a land-based church or a land-based ministry. That is the vision for the Global Church Net. I pray that it resonates with your heart. It gives everybody an opportunity to be empowered, to be equipped. And for those, like I said, whether where you're part of a cluster in some part of the world, we are able to extend the territory of the Lord through planting a church. And the, 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 the church, just, just one or two things about the, 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 the church. The church is the plan of the, the leadership of the church. We are just there to empower and to help and make sure that there's a smooth birthing and a smooth birthing and a smooth transition. Get in touch. Let me know. Let, let me know what your thoughts are. God bless.